And those of you who have heard or seen me speak one or 50 times in the last year, um, I don't normally oh know God. exactly what I'm going to say until I start talking, but this was a little bit more important, so I kind of actually have my thoughts written down for the first time. Um, so forgive me for that. And I'm actually really glad that the majority of the people are already gone. So. Uh, because I'm probably going to get emotional. But today, honestly, guys, is a really historic day for Sutter County. And it's an even better and most more wonderful day for the women residents of Sutter County. Yeah. For the first time, we have a female district attorney. And I'm thinking most likely it's going to be me, but something could change. So forget what I'm about to say if it changes. Um, <laughs> it's been truly an honor to be a candidate in this race to go through this election. And I hope that part of my story will resonate with each woman in Sutter County, whether as it be as a, a mother, wife, daughter, volunteer, lawyer, or working parent. And you know what? Not just Sutter County, but Yuba County and everywhere. So all of you guys who are here today visiting, thank you. Look um, We are all in this together, all of us. And there's a part of each of us in each other's stories. Walking and talking to residents, from school kids to veterans and everyone in between has been one of the highlights of this campaign. To get to hear each other's stories, to share mine, to listen. My time as a defense attorney has been an amazing experience. It's helped me see the importance of the story from different perspectives. And I look forward to bringing the art of listening and communication with me to the Sutter County District Attorney's Office. I've been able to listen to voters say what they want and they want change. They have said that integrity matters. And I've listened to voters say that they want transparency. They want accountability. And I'm not gonna quit listening to the people of Sutter County. <laughs> okay, I wanna thank my husband, Brian. That's me. <laughs> We don't know where they are, so don't worry about that. Declan, Jameson, and Jacob. <laughs> for making this matter, for making my heart complete, and for bringing joy, even through all of the difficulties. <laughs> I need to thank my parents, because honestly, I don't even want to guess how many hours that we have put into this campaign, and I think they're probably pretty close to where I am, because every time I went somewhere, they either babysat or went with me or supported me, and my dad has, I don't know, probably walked at least 60% of the precincts in Sutter County himself. Right on, Dad! <laughs> where they're effective 
and to maximize all of our work so that we can work and produce justice. And guys, that's the only promise I've made and that's the only promise I'm going to make. Actually, that's not true. I made another promise. My other promise is, is I will always listen. I will listen to the people of Sutter County. And guess what? I'm also going to enjoy some time with my family after today. So that's going to be fun too. Thank you to my family, friends, and supporters. Again, thank you. All right. So tonight would not have been possible without some of you um, urging, manhandling, strongholding me into doing this. Thank you. Yeah, thanks, Manny. Without your endorsements, your contributions, your work, and your moral support, this wouldn't have happened. And I am so blessed to live in a county and in a community that has people who care enough to do what you have done, to work the way that you have worked. We are all blessed because of you. And our future is great. We have hope. We have a lot of possibility, a lot of potential, and I am so excited to go back to the district attorney's office and work with the people there who want change just like the rest of us, who want to be the best that we can be. So we are going to do that together, and I'm grateful for the support that I've received from them to make that happen. There is going to be difficulty. There's going to be challenging days ahead, but we're going to weather that storm together and we are going to make change. I'm grateful for the increased knowledge and appreciation that I've gained for Sutter County, for its rich diversity, and for the closeness that I've developed with so many amazing members of our community. Um, I want to say a minute, Ms. Dupre, was a formidable opponent, and I enjoyed the opportunities that we had to share the stage in public forums. I stand here today, and I am proud of the campaign that we ran.